Hello everyone, welcome. This is Feline Intuition 1111. This is going to be a collective reading. Let's see what messages want to come out for you. What are the messages for the collective? What are the messages? Oh, so we have finances, new love, soulmates, and fear. Okay, so. Hmm. Some of you, there could be, hold on, let me see. What are the messages for the collective? Sweeping things under the rug. Secret admirer, ooh. Okay, we got two, okay. So we got secret admirer. Sweeping things under the rug. Okay, sorry about that, it got a bit noisy, so. We have most of the story. Something unknown will be revealed. Something isn't adding up. Read between the lines. Lies and deceit. We have someone close to you has eyes for your boo. Fooling around behind your back. Envy, wanting what you have. Smiling in your face, but doing your dirty behind your back. It doesn't have to be all of those things. There's definitely some kind of envy going on or some kind of... Definitely someone smiling in your face, especially with the more to the story card. But we got spirit force ending so something could have ended because of someone's hidden intentions towards you this could be a friendship that ended could be a relationship because you do have new love soulmate and secret admirer so some of you may have recently got out of something but it could be a blessing in disguise because that person could have been fake or it could have been a friendship you got out of but let's see What are the messages for the collective? What are the messages? Okay, so some of you could find out someone was taken from you could find out the truth about someone's yes you're gonna find out the truth about whoever this seven of swords is whoever was doing this or being fake in front of your face or behind your back you're gonna find out i'm seeing that when this does happen you're gonna be restored like something's gonna be restored i don't know if this person was stealing from you Sabotaging your relationship, doing stuff behind your back, whoever this was, but you're going to find something out. Why the Knight of Pentacles in reverse? Yeah, you're taking back your power here in some situation that was slowed down by somebody, but you didn't know what was going on. Why the Seven of Swords? Yeah, there could be, for some of you, there could have been an old friend from the past who is um, who was trying to maybe sabotage your relationship, get with your person, or steal from you, take from you. Why the five of pentacles in reverse? This is weird because it started off with really good cards. But there seems to be something going on behind the scenes. I, I feel like it's coming to... The point where you're finding out and you know releasing it but it has something to do with you glowing up becoming successful at something or being in some kind of spotlight and moving away from a certain group of people or person i don't know if they were trying to hinder you the whole time but you broke free without even realizing that someone was trying to hinder you why the Ace of Swords. Yeah. You're going to find out the truth about somebody. King of Cups in Reverse, Queen of Cups in Reverse, Empress in Reverse. There's some insecure person. Someone with some kind of emotional issues. Maybe they're immature, narcissistic. They need to grow up. They don't know how to handle, I don't know, their emotions, conflict. They could have been standing in the way of something for you. 
why the world in reverse nine of pentacles in reverse yeah it could be financial we do have finances but it could be love whatever it is somebody was getting in the way of something for you maybe causing financial issues maybe taken from you maybe sabotaging you in some way behind this it feels like behind the scenes whatever this is but the fall in reverse okay why the why the lovers in reverse let me see what's going on here it's like someone was getting joy from taking something from you being happy causing stagnation it, see the finances you see the work or love why the seven of cups in reverse why the chariot in reverse so they were creating some kind of illusion there's jealousy involved here they were keeping an eye on you something's gonna pick up for you when this when you either when you find out or something's gonna happen with this person where they just can't do it anymore behind the scenes they can't take from you or they may try to get with your person but your person rejects them something behind the scenes that causes this, this person to stop or not be able to take from you anymore and you start to see see something happening differently for you like an improvement i need to look at the main spread this is like this is going to require some detective work because okay there could be a gemini leo taurus cancer libra let's see Oh my goodness. <laughs> You're going to get the truth. Okay. What's going on here? What are the messages for the collective? What are the messages for the collective? see it's like this love is in reverse then it's the queen of swords you're being seen as a queen of swords so it's like there's something and someone's afraid of authority so maybe what they were doing wasn't even legal well they just see see you as authority because they see you as a queen of swords and their fear is the emperor so whoever is doing whatever is afraid of getting caught terrified of getting caught let's see clarify the queen of swords please so hmm Someone thinks and speaks negatively of you. Why the why the eight of pentacles in reverse? Someone feels like you um, get a lot effortlessly. Why the lovers in reverse?
This King of Pentacles keeps coming out. It's here twice. You may have a new person coming in. A soulmate energy. This person could be very stable. Financially, especially. Because he's here twice. For some of you, this could be your new love. And the person doing something behind the scene could be your ex. But for some of you, it could be an ex-friend. There is somebody envious. It's very hidden. I don't know why it feels like this. Hold on. Why the Ten of Cups in reverse? Could be a Sagittarius for some of you. Someone's waiting for something to fall apart for you because they're insecure. This insecure thing keeps coming out. Like they don't attract as well as you do. They don't manifest as well as you do. And they're waiting for you to have Ten of Cups in reverse. To no longer be happy. Why the Emperor? They was they could have been doing something that wasn't legal. They could have been act like actually stealing. Because they're afraid of authority. The five of pentacles in reverse. Someone could have been actually stealing that where they could actually go to jail. Or they're afraid of you finding out something. Why the five of cups? There's some kind of loss and disappointment that happened. But it was there was an illusion. This blocking is the four of pen four of wands. Some things could be things could have been going missing or your finances could could have been going slow or your relationship could have been going south and you maybe thought that it was for one reason, but really it's somebody behind the scenes. Hold on, why the four of wands? Yeah, Queen of Wands in reverse. King of Wands. What is going on here? It's weird because we got new love soulmate, secret admirer. But then we have this whole other story. So I'm like, are you in a new connection or about to be while there's some really negative people surrounding you or trying to pull strings but whoever these people are they gossip and they're very egotistic and jealous they seem to like like they would stop at nothing whoever these people are why the king of pentacles someone's move towards you is you see okay two of cups in reverse but someone's move towards you is very positive there's this really positive thing going on for you, but then there's this really negative thing. And I'm trying to figure out, are these are both these things happening at the same time? Are you connecting with someone right now or in the near future while something really sneaky is going on behind your back? I don't feel like it's to do with the person that you're dealing with because they are coming towards you with really good energy. I'm not picking up anything bad from them. So I don't know if it's someone close to you trying to get with your person. Maybe they're jealous of your relationship with them. But your person turns them down. Because they want you to have this Ten of Cups in reverse. This could be someone who is jealous that you have someone and they don't. Why the Page of Cups in reverse? Yeah, for some of you, it could be your new person's ex. Either your ex-friend or your new person's ex. If this is a person trying to get with a new person that you're with or going to be with, it's either your ex-friend or their ex. 
because there's something here about someone being like really emotionally upset and childish like someone in a really emotionally immature energy and it's because you're getting attention that they're not or you're getting something that they're not I'm hearing for some of you if, if you're de if you're dealing with someone who has kids from a previous relationship their baby mom or baby dad could be trying to like really take up all their time get all their attention why the ten why the nine of pentacles in reverse so you're gonna be a lot of you are not gonna be single soon Especially if you start going out more, coming out of your shell. There's this page of cups here. But it may cause someone to feel left out in the cold. Purify um, more to the story, please. Why did this come out? You see, what is going on? Five of swords, three of swords. Someone is... And the Ten of Cups in reverse again. Someone's trying to do something. It could be one of you guys' ex or an ex. It seems like somebody um, who knows you or knows your situation. Someone who has some kind of emotional attachment to this situation. To where they would want to like sabotage it. Or someone who is just, just jealous. Clarify this envy card, please. Yeah, someone's jealous of your relationship. The lovers keeps coming out. It could be this person that you're dealing with. Their, it could be their ex or it's a friend or family member of yours. But they're jealous of the relationship. That's, what's, that's what it is with the Three of Swords. Someone like... Someone hasn't gotten over somebody. Clarify sweeping things under the rug. So you may be someone, okay, I don't know, like if this person, this envious person is linked to you, you may be very like manifesty and just, you know, not letting anything bother you just being in the flow attracting this could really bother this envious person they feel like you get things too easily this is just the way they think if it's someone linked to you someone feels like they're kind of bothered by you not being reactive to their drama could be a gemini sagittarius taurus aries Taurus again, Aquarius, Virgo, Leo, Gemini again. Why the secret admirer card? Why is this here? Seven of Wands in reverse. Hmm. It could be. F Sorry, I just brushed the mic. For some of you, the secret admirer is could be trying to get away from somebody to be with you. But their ex or whoever is attached to them is, is obsessive. Clarify the soulmates. And the new love. Could be a Scorpio for some of you. Yeah. Your love life changing. You getting a valuable offer in love. Why did the finances come out? So the finances. You see, there was some. There's so I don't know. Because it seems linked to your finances as well. So maybe it's both for some of you. For others, it could be just someone's affecting your finances or someone's affecting your love life, but. There's some type of injustice here. Someone may have been stealing from you if, if you only resonate with the financial part. But 
and the five of cups again there was some type of loss but you probably don't know that somebody did this but you're gonna find out the truth let me see what are the messages for the collective pride arrogance ego stubborn describes the people in the situation the ones who are these two these king of king of wands and king of king of wands and queen of wands in reverse messages for the collective chemistry attraction sparks it's like this beautiful love story is happening but then there's this dark side happening too what in the world Conflict, decisions, hot and cold, multiple choices. We also have only you, devoted, attached, crave. So either you, you could have had multiple choices, but you've chosen this person, or they could have. Maybe someone they didn't choose is now mad at you. But... This is a lot... I feel like I don't want to leave anything unsaid because there's a secret thing going on under the surface, beneath the surface. What are the messages for the collective? You made your bed, now lay in it. Okay, snapped out of control. I can't even show this image, so... Um, careful with how far this person could go whoever is doing stuff behind the scenes we got the offer will you accept revenge settle in the score this is someone you know or cold shoulder distance dramatic loves to start things this person feels like someone who's just young immature caught feelings for someone got rejected and now they're wanting to actually respond in a very immature way we got unpredictable so i don't know if this person's ex is young or just immature or if your ex-friend or whoever this could be for you is just immature doesn't know how to handle their emotions doesn't know how to stop being jealous doesn't know how to focus on themselves but they're like really affected all the messages for the collective control releasing taking back power True love, pure love, honest connection, money, wealth, love, finances. It's like it's either money or it's love with this situation or both for some of you. But we got friendship. So this could either this could be an ex-friend of yours or they're trying to make friends with you to get close to you. So be careful of any like strange person like who is like adamant about being friends with you, getting close. Could be this person's ex without you even knowing travel vacation honeymoon enjoyment we have karma toxic story new opportunities it's funny because usually the um witchcraft story comes out it kind of feels like like, okay, I've said in the past readings where, where um, it comes out that someone could have done a spell. Usually I'm like that person, like who would go that far? This is the type of person who I think would go that far. It's funny that I'm not seeing the spell work in this reading because I feel like this person would be the type to go that far, to do that, to affect you in every way or any way. I'm not seeing that. I'm seeing more of like manipulation, sabotage, even trying to befriend you. Let's see.
What are the messages for the collective? Don't put more effort into... Sorry, don't put more effort than them into this connection. Definitely. Especially if they have somebody still attached to them. You are blocking your blessings. Oh my God, could you be this mystery person? Blocking your own blessings, sabotaging your own relationship. I'm just joking. I mean, it could be, but... I'm hearing you are your most, your most your worst enemy. So if you feel like it's you, if you feel like nobody's behind the scenes doing anything, you feel like it could just be you, your mind, your beliefs, then maybe this is a sign to heal or start working on some new beliefs. But it does look like a person, I'm gonna be honest, like somebody, somebody who's like really jealous. We have give them more space than they ask for. We have true love requires compromise. It really looks like it's telling you to not fall in love with this person too soon or fall back in love with, with them if it's someone that you're reconciling with too soon. There's an emphasis on needing to one, protect yourself and focus on yourself. Because there's something that's going to be uncovered here. Clarify the money card. Okay, so you got like... I feel like when you find out the truth, if your situation is to do with money, it will, like you will... Maybe it's someone who tricked you into, into believing something was more expensive than it really was and the truth comes out, maybe authorities get involved and you get your money back. We have a 10 of cups, 10 of pentacles. So it could be that someone tricked you out of a deal and you find out that it that you actually are owed all of this money. So for some of you, if none of this made sense, it could be that maybe you, have, you unknowingly have money coming in because somebody did something behind the scenes, lied to you. The truth comes out and you get your money. Because um, you got the Ten of Pentacles clarifying this, which means this is coming in. Let's clarify the true love. Yeah, there's definitely a jealous person surrounding the love situation. They're watching it. They're watching this connection of yours. Clarify revenge, please. Who's trying to get revenge and how and why? Someone who's jealous, a jealous lover. They keep coming out as a page, this person. So they're immature. They have, they, I don't know. Their emotions are linked to this. So it's either your ex or their ex. If it's not an ex, then it's an ex-friend or family member who is extremely jealous. Maybe, I don't know, maybe they're delusional in some way. But it's someone who is, whose feelings are causing them to do this. Clarify the the snapped card out of control. Careful of this person if if this is making sense to you. Because we got the moon here. Why the moon? Don't accept friendship from any strange person, I would say. Because clarifying the moon is this Ten of Swords and the King of Swords. So either they're planning something just terrible, which you need to protect yourself, or this is them hurting like secretly, but putting on a, a 
acting like they're not bothered with the king of swords so this could be your ex acting like they're not hurt that you moved on or that you're moving on or their ex or a friend family member who is acting like they're not feeling some type of way about your happiness these feelings are hidden and they're dark and this person doesn't really know how to deal with these emotions Clarify um, you're blocking your blessings. What's this about? Some of you might be blocking your own financial blessings with your mind. Careful of your um, thoughts as well. Um, let me see. What could be triggering this person who is having all this anger? Forgotten. I felt invisible and forgotten by you as if I never existed. <clears throat> so this could be someone who... Hold on. I felt out of touch with reality because everything I knew was being deflected. I woke up and saw the truth. We have past lover, the display of affection you have towards your former partner <laughs> triggers my insecurities. We have argument. When I feel angry, I, sorry, when I feel angry and irritated, I will start an argument, if not soothed. This is speaking about someone who is not healing. So this could be their ex with the past lover card. It could be them watching their affections towards you. It could be, um, because when it comes to the person you're with or going to be with, it's all good. It's all like, and there's nothing wrong with this person other than the cards telling you to take it slow but it's like they left someone behind or you did hold on clarify the gaslighting somebody Emperor in reverse. Some I feel like okay, either this is talking about your ex or whoever this person is, they have some type of trauma where they may have been gaslighted as a child or at some point where they just it's something about them where they don't know how to handle their emotions. And they don't like, like they would view a relationship as, for example, if this is your person's ex, they could have felt like, you know, they were going to get married, have a future. Like they could have imagined their whole life with this person. And then this person may have just left. Maybe it wasn't working out. Maybe this, maybe they were too immature. So they moved on left this person behind because this person was too immature because I feel like this person is like I said emotionally immature so they would kind of be the type to have a fairy tale in their mind and not really stick with reality and then when reality falls apart they don't know what to do this is definitely someone who has an emotional investment in you or in the person you're dealing with I feel like as long as you protect yourself, you'll be fine. Whether it be spiritually or physically. There's something about authorities as well. I feel like that's more to do with the financial. Like if you were stolen from financially, you will be getting your money back. Finding out the truth about the situation and getting your money back.
For some of you, it could have been someone trying to scam you and you get your money back. Whatever it is, there's an amazing thing going on on the surface, but beneath the surface, something there's something going on. Let me get some love cards here. What are the messages for the collective? Absence. I feel like a part of me is missing without you. Disagreements. I wish you, you understood how I feel. Space. I need more time to think. Inseparable. Our love is always there despite the distance. Some of you, this could be a long distance connection. Whoever this person is who is overly attached, they could feel like a part of themselves is missing without somebody. They feel like no one understands how they feel, but it's because they don't know how to um, deal with their feelings and be responsible for their feelings. Why the pride card? Someone who's having a hard time dealing with rejection or a breakup. Five of Cups again. So is one of you guys' ex. That's the strongest story coming through. One of you guys' ex is, is having a hard time. The breakup is hurt in their pride, making them see things differently. And they... It's like they're not giving themselves time at all. Okay, those of you who are involved with someone, what's the message from this person? We both need time to heal. I am working on myself so I can come back. Please wait for me. You are so beautiful inside and out and we have I am moving on with my life. So you could be moving on from someone or your new person could be moving on from someone. Somebody feels like if it's a past person coming back that you're actually going to be with, they are working on themselves, but they could have left someone behind. For some of you, there's a past person who sees himself as coming forward but you could be moved on and what I'm seeing what's the conflict here multiple choices yeah it's like somebody had multiple choices but made a decision it could even be you who left someone behind maybe there was an, maybe you had an option that you were dating casually who took it way too seriously. Whatever this is, whatever it is, it seems like this connection is happening, but somebody is kind of hurt over it or jealous of it. And you'll find out who that is. If it's a money situation, you'll find out and get the money back. But definitely be safe until you find out what's going on here because her find the most of the story is this, which is clearly somebody is trying to do something. It does say something unknown will be revealed. So you can look forward to finding out the truth about what's going on. So the signs that have come out, Capricorn, Taurus, Aquarius. Virgo, Sagittarius, Libra, Gemini, Capricorn again, Scorpio, Libra again, Leo, um, Pisces, 
Aquarius. Higher signs for sure. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Aries. Taurus again, Gemini again. Who is this? Okay. So those are the main signs. Let's see. Hold on. Yeah, those are the main signs. So I hope this was helpful. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.